somewhere. And the girls have taken over downstairs. So I decided to sneak upstairs with a hooker. Let's go with hooker, Irish stout. So, go with hooker's Irish stout comes in at 4.5%. I'd be expecting this to kind of have most of the traits you'd expect in a stout, so a nice dark colour. Some dark malt notes like uh, roastiness, kind of burnt toast, maybe dark chocolate, some kind of a dark bitterness anyway, like uh, maybe uh, coffee flavours in there as well. So yeah, let's give this a try and see how it measures up. Alright, so this beer poured by the head. It's quite sprightly actually. It's a beautiful dark colour, almost just black. Mmm. You can smell toffee. Some coffee. There's a little bit of fruitiness in there, maybe kind of a dark cherry or something. It's quite nice, got a typical kind of stout smell. It's pretty good. Give it a try. Wow. Oh. The bitterness just waits until the very end to kick in. <laughs> See, it's a very sprightly body. The tongue is quite lively. There's caramel and toffee flavours in there. Some burnt flavours, a little bit of coffee. Hmm. It's a really good balance between sweet and bitter. I don't think it's very hoppy at all. I wouldn't have expected it to be though, so. Mmm. It's quite nice, quite refreshing. It has a beautiful drying effect on the tongue. It really prompts you to take the next sip. It's a really good stout. Mm. Okay, I'm going to drink away at this. Enjoy it. I'll come back to my final impression. Because, yeah, so far it's pretty damn good. This has been a very enjoyable beer. Once it settles into the flavours, it's a real roasty flavour with kind of a coffee finish in each sip. The alcohol level is like 4.5%, so it's quite low, but there's still this wonderful warming sensation from the alcohol. It's absolutely brilliant. The body feel is really light though, so I do call this a porter rather than a stout. That's not a big complaint though. I still like it's still a wonderful beer. Just it wasn't quite what I'd expect from a stout. I rate this beer quite high. This beer was excellent, excellent beer. It's actually the kind of beer that you know, you don't have to sit and sip, you know, you could go out and actually have a session with this beer. It's a very, very sessionable beer, but it also lends itself to, you know, as I've been doing, sitting and relaxing, having a couple of sips every now and then. It's a really, really good beer. I think I'll give it 7.5 out of 10. Really is excellent. Really, really enjoyed it. So yeah, oh, it's wonderful, absolutely wonderful. Hmm, double thumbs, yeah, double thumbs up. Cheers.